Yo, it's your boy the Android Doctor back again with another tutorial video. Okay, so this time I'll be showing you how to flash TWRP recovery onto the Moto G8 Plus. So TWRP recovery allows you to install custom ROMs and modifications and a whole lot more. So um, there's one requirement to do this. You will need to have a unlocked bootloader. So if you don't know how to unlock your bootloader, you can go watch my video on how to easily unlock the bootloader on your G8 Plus. I will link that video in the description down below. Go follow that video, unlock your bootloader, then you can come back to this video to install TWRP recovery. Um, okay, so I want to do a quick disclaimer. You do this at your own risk. If anything goes wrong, I will not be held responsible. Just thought I'd let you know that. Okay, so if you do decide to follow this, this is what you need to do to flash TWRP recovery. So when you first unlock the bootloader, you should still have ADB minimal fastboot installed on your C drive, on your PC. So just go to your C drive. and check that it's there, program files x86 and you should still have the minimal ADB and fastboot folder okay so just go ahead and download the TWRP file I will link the TWRP file in the description down below just go ahead and download it and save it to your desktop and then just drag and drop it into the minimal ADB and fastboot folder and just hit continue and it should be right there so it's now in the minimal ADB and fastboot folder okay so next you just want to power off your phone and then put the phone into fastboot mode and to do that you just simply press the volume down button and the power button at the same time so just keep both buttons held down volume down and power until it takes you to this screen here where it says fast boot flash mode secure okay so you can put the phone down for now okay so in the minimal adb and fast boot folder just find a blank space anywhere in here and you're simply going to press shift on your keyboard and right click on your mouse so shift and right click on your mouse and then you will see this little box pop up select open command window here I'm just going to move this a second Okay, so now connect your phone to the USB cable and your PC. So connect it and then it should say USB connected. <coughs> and now just look for the TWRP file that you copied to the minimal ADB and fastboot folder right click on it select rename and it should then be highlighted in blue just like this right click on it again and select copy let me just get the camera to focus guys so you can see better Okay, so in the black box here, you're just going to type, come on camera, focus. You're just going to type fast boot space boot space again. And then you're just going to paste the name of the TWRP recovery into there, just like that. And right here at the end... You're just going to put dot .img 
so it should all be looking like that and then just hit enter and it should say downloading boot image ok and it should show the amount of seconds that it's taken the phone will then reboot straight into TWRP recovery and there you have it so the phone has booted straight into TWRP recovery and you will have to do this every time you want to boot into TWRP recovery mode and um, if you want to flash it permanently all you have to do is go into mount storage Okay, just reboot. Reboot system. So that method what I showed you is just a temporary flash, but if you want to install it permanently, Just connect the phone to the USB cable once again and get access to the internal storage. And copy the TWRP file onto your internal storage And then open back up your minimal ADB and fast boot. You can close down your internal storage now. So just open back up your minimal ADB and fast boot. And power off the device. Go back into fast boot mode by pressing volume down and power. Reconnect the phone to the USB cable. And once again, just find a blank space in the minimal ADB and fast boot folder. And you're just going to press shift and right click on your mouse select open command window here right click on the name of the TWRP file select rename it and then copy it And then once again in this box, you're just going to type fast boot boot. So fast boot space boot space again. Paste the name of the recovery. Into there. 
and at the end just put dot img remember make sure your cable and everything's connected and then just hit enter and once again it's going to flash the TWRP file and then the device is going to boot into TWRP recovery mode you can unplug the phone and now just go to where it says advanced and select install recovery ram disk and select the file here it is and just swipe to install and now it's going to be flashed to the device permanently And it should then say image flash completed and it's just backing up the boot image and now just select reboot system once it says successful select reboot system Okay, and, and anytime you want to go into TWRP recovery, just power off the device. And press volume down and power. Until it takes you into fast boot and then use the volume down button to locate recovery mode don't know if you can all see that just use the volume down till it says recovery mode and then use the power button to enter the TWRP recovery mode Okay guys, so it's that simple. So yeah, this was just my video showing you how to install TWRP recovery onto the Moto G8 Plus. If it helped you out, you already know what to do. Give the video a thumbs up, share the video, subscribe for more videos because I will be making quite a few more videos on the Moto G8 Plus. See by the Android Doctor and I'm out. See you in the next video. Doses. Oh yeah. Let me just reboot this. So reboot, go back to system. And the phone will boot back up as normal. So yeah, it's your boy the Android Doctor. I'm out. Stay tuned, remember guys. There'll be more tutorials coming for this device.